we one point out? I mean, uh, with the amount of games we have left, uh, pretty much we have to win. Our, our future's in our hands, so we'll do you know do everything we can to get in. What are we guys talking about today then after the rough weekend? How do you I mean, obviously nobody's happy. You know, you don't get any points on the weekend, but uh, at the same time, you know. Uh, we got to look to uh, you know forward to tomorrow and, and and hope to get two points tomorrow. How frustrating is it when you guys out shoot them at like thirty on Friday night? And you can't get away? It's definitely frustrating, but uh, I mean you have to focus on the positives and and like you said we outshot them, you know, fifth or forty five to to whatever. Um, but at, at the end of the day we didn't get the two points, so so that's what we're we're focusing on, you know, tightening up our D zone and and making sure that we, you know, don't as allow, allow as many goals. As a veteran, do you what are you telling teammates in the locker room right now? What's important? Ah, uh, just tighten up our D zone. I mean, it, it seems like you know every time the other team gets a chance, it's a goal. So, you know, just limiting the other team's chances and and doing our best in our end first. It's kind of hard mixing all these new faces in during a playoff push. I mean, absolutely. I mean, with uh, like you said, all the young kids coming in and. It's definitely different and uh, something I'm not really used to, but uh, I mean, we're, we're making the best of it. And what about the Milwaukee game tomorrow? Talk about your thoughts on it. Have to win. That's pretty much it. It's do or die at this point. So.